Speakwa Barnacle Vibe 3.0 entitled Blue. As you may have guessed, this is a Bluetooth speaker, and I admit I'm kind of obsessed with these things. But what intrigued me about this, it is the first device I have seen that is claimed to be IP68 100% waterproof. Is it? This is the miniature manual they include. I guess they don't want to waste paper on something that most people won't read. But I read it, not with my eyes, but through the miracle of enlargement. On this page, they explain very enthusiastically just how waterproof this speaker is. I want to read for you word for word what they say about its waterproof features. I'll be looking over here at my enlargement, but, so bear with me. The barnacle upholds the highest rating of water protection. Eight! capable of withstanding full water immersion, a depth of one meter for up to 60 minutes. In marketing terms, I believe this is what is called a lie. If a speaker claims to be waterproof, I test it. I power it up, I pair it with my phone, I start the music, and I throw it in the sink. Now in this case, it has a suction cup mount, so I stuck it to the bottom of the sink. It started out strong, but it only got about three and a half songs before it sputtered and died. What's that, like 12 minutes? Far short of the 60 minutes they claim. I love finding good products, but I also don't mind verbally destroying bad ones when they disappoint me. And this one did disappoint me because they were so enthusiastic about their waterproof claims. But it did grow on me. Before we get any further, let's just get the weaknesses out of the way. It's not a big speaker. It's not that loud. It might be loud enough for the situation but it's not going to deafen you. It doesn't have a lot of bass. It doesn't have a lot of treble. It's a mid-range speaker, but I have to admit, it has some features that I like and you won't find anywhere else. Like this squid design, for example. One of the features I like is what they call the four-in-one mounting system. Have you ever seen a Bluetooth speaker with a suction cup on it? But the suction cup is only one of your options. You can easily remove it with a few twists of your hand and underneath it is this carabiner loop. And if that's not enough, you get this GoPro compatible mount. Just to summarize the four in one mounting system, we have the carabiner loop, the suction cup, the GoPro mount. Um, I guess the fourth one is no mount? As with many waterproof speakers, the buttons are embossed on the body of the device, which in practice make them a bit difficult to read unless you are viewing them magnified on a screen. You do have an equalizer button, which gives you two options, indoor and outdoor. I don't think there's a tremendous difference between the two, but the outdoor sounds slightly brighter to me. There's a USB port toward the bottom of the speaker, it's kind of difficult to find because it's underneath this plug. They do include this cable, but you will need to provide your own charger. In addition to charging the device, you can attach this to your computer and load up to 2,000 songs to the Vibe 3.0's 8 megabytes of internal memory. As far as I can tell, there is no randomized function, so you will have to load the songs to the device in the order you want to hear them. Not ideal, I know. If you happen to have two of these, you can pair them to a single Bluetooth source. It's not the same as stereo. They call it surround mode. I don't know if anyone will actually do this, but you can use this as a speakerphone. I thought the person on the other side sounded pretty clear, but they said they had trouble hearing me. The Barnacle Vibe has an 8-hour battery, which is acceptable but not amazing. What rating would I give the Barnacle Vibe 3.0? I ordered it because of the claims of being 100% waterproof, IP68 certified, which was a total lie. However, it's not without its charms. The speaker sounds okay. The 8-hour battery life is decent. I haven't seen this 4-in-1 mounting system anywhere else, and I like the ability to load 2,000 songs to its 8 megabytes of internal memory. I don't know how many waterproof speakers I've tested where the SD card has fried when you got it wet. As I was playing with this, I noticed this is not just a clip. It is a carabiner, but that doesn't change my rating. Three out of five stars. Thanks for stopping by. Thank you.